Welcome back to another quick tip. Motion blur is that streak-like effect that occurs when shooting a still image or animation of a moving object. The results are incredibly dynamic, so in this video, I'll show you how to use Keyshot to add motion blur to your still images. You can find the motion blur setting in the animation timeline. You might be familiar with adding motion blur to animations, but you can also use it in still images. The process is pretty much the same, meaning you'll have to create an animation first. On this model of a toy airplane, we're going to create a rotation animation on the propeller. You can use the animation wizard or just right click on the part in the scene tree. Once you have that animation created, make sure motion blur is enabled. Drag the playback handle back a few frames and you should see a bit of motion blur on your part. Now if you want to see more motion blur, you need to go into the settings on your animation and increase the degree of rotation. So if I bump this up to 180, you can see a lot more motion blur because that part is rotating much faster. From here, you can render this as usual. Just note that you might need a higher sample count in order to see smooth blending between these frames, and this could increase your render time. But as you can see, motion blur can really bring an image to life. Thanks for watching this Keyshot Quick Tip. Leave a comment below with your thoughts, and don't forget to subscribe for more helpful content. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like and share it with your friends.